is the American Radio Relay League's Morse code training tape number two, side two. The tape was produced by the American Radio Relay League in Newington, Connecticut, copyright 1989. This side of the tape contains six sample amateur radio QSOs. They are similar to the code exams used by the American Radio Relay League Volunteer Examiner Coordinator. Each practice session begins with the letter V sent six times in two groups of three. Each practice session lasts about six minutes. These sample QSOs are designed to prepare you for the five word per minute novice code test. There is a ten question quiz to go with each sample QSO printed at the end of chapter three in Tune in the World with Ham Radio. If you can copy Morse code at five words per minute, you should have no trouble answering the questions. We have not printed a copy of the transcript for this side of the tape, nor are the answers to the quiz questions in Tune in the World. Here's the first practice QSO. Good luck!
If you didn't copy that solid or had trouble with the quiz questions, go back and listen to the first QSO again. When you're ready, listen to the next practice session.
These sample QSOs are very much like what you'll hear on the novice bands. Here's another seven minutes of practice.
If your examiner uses an ARRL novice code test, you will be asked to answer 10 questions like the quiz questions in Chapter 3 of Tune in the World. If you have problems with the questions, rewind the tape and listen to the practice again. When you're ready, listen to the next sample QSO. Thank you. 
If you can copy these practice sessions, you will have no problems with the novice code test. Here's another seven and a half minutes of practice.
And now the last sample QSO. Thank you. 
That is the end of the code practice on this tape and the end of the American Radio Relay League's Morse code teaching kit. If you need more practice, rewind the tape to the first QSO or try some of the word practice on the other side again. The American Radio Relay League also has other practice tapes available to help improve your ability with Morse code. If you have a receiver, you should listen to some of the stations in the novice bands and the W1AW code practice.